Hey, what up, guys? It's Graham. And last time on Skyrim, we were doing the Dawnguard stuff. We made it to the castle courtyard, and we were doing uh, looking for a dragon scroll or an elder scroll. Anyway, whatever. I skipped the whole dungeon here because we've already done it. We're getting close. I'm sure of it. Yes, we are very close. We're actually at the part where uh, we have to open this secret passage. Let us do so. Anyway, if you really want to watch the dungeon, uh, you can just go back and watch that episode where he did it as a vampire. Um, I'll leave a link in the description to that episode, so you don't have to search for it on your own. So, now, I wanted to show this part because um, it's slightly different here than in the vampire portion of a Dawn Guard. Ooh, Daedra Heart. Get that! Get the Daedra Heart! Yup! Hey, where's Serana? Get your ass over here. Talk! Speak, woman! Look at this place. This has to be it. Yep. I knew she was deep into necromancy. I mean, she taught me everything I know. But I had no idea she had a setup like this. Yeah, pretty fancy, huh? Look at all this. Need she must have spent years collecting these components. And what's this thing? What thing? That's what she said? Oh. <laughs> okay. I'm not sure oh. about this circle, but it's obviously something. It is something. That's gotta be something. Yoink! Black soul gem, grand soul gem. Let's take a look oh. around. There has to be something here that tells us where she's gone. Yeah, there's gotta be something. What are we looking for? My mother was meticulous about her research. If we can find her notes, there might be some hints in there. Notas. Let us get the notas. Fortunately, so I know where they are already, right? Meow. Valerius notes. Valer Valerica Valericia's notes. Hey. Any luck yet? Found them. Found your mommy's notes. You did? Let me see them. Okay. What's the soul I only know what she told me. She had a theory about soul gems, that the souls inside of them don't just vanish when they're used. They end up in the soul cairn. Uh, why she care? The Soul Cairn is home to very powerful beings. Necromancers send them souls and receive powers of their own in return. My mother spent a lot of time trying to contact them directly, to travel to the Soul Cairn itself. Crazy, uh, think we'll find her? That circle in the center of the room is definitely some type of portal. If I'm reading this right, there's a formula here that should give us safe passage into the Soul Cairn. What do we need? A handful of soul gem shards, some finely ground bone meal, a good bit of purified void salts. Oh, damn it. What's wrong? We're also going to need a sample of her blood, which, if we could get that, we wouldn't even be trying to do this in the first place. Uh, you share her blood. Hmm, not bad. We'd better hope that's good enough. Mistakes with these kind of portals can be... gruesome. Anyway, Gross. enough of that. Let's get started. Let's go. Are oh, all the ingredients here? Mother would have plenty of those materials in her laboratory. You just need to find them. Okay, let's just go and find them then, shall we? I believe the last of our ingredients should be over here. There we go. Oh, oh, no. oh we need these fire salts too. Yeah. Yoink. Yoink. Yes, we need that for that development uh, mission. Okay, we did it. We did it. What's your face, Serana? Just put him in here. Plop, 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 plop. Plop. Then the rest is up to me. Are you ready to go? Let's I'm do this. I'm not entirely sure what this thing is going to do when I add my blood. Mm, maybe it'll take it to, to the soul cairn, maybe. I don't know. I wouldn't know. I've never played this before. Then the rest before. is up to me. <laughs> Are you ready to go? Yeah, I'm not let's go. I'm entirely sure what this thing is going to do uh, when uh, I add my blood. Come on. Okay. Have at her. Do it. Do it. Do it. Why aren't you doing it? Do it. Do it. Do I have then to tell you to do it? To me. Are you ready I'm to ready! Okay, here goes. Let's go. Do it. Eh, 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 eh. By the blood of my ancestors. How did you just stop bleeding like that? I created a portal with a soul camp. Incredible. Okay, cool. Let's have at it. Hooah! Nyah! Nyah! Let's go. Am I burning? Ow! I'm like taking damage. What the f? Are you all right? That looked painful. Yeah, it hurt. What happened? Now that I think about it, 
I should have expected that. Sorry. Yeah, that's what's different. It's hard to describe. The soul cairn is... Well, hungry, for lack of a better word. It's trying to take your life essence as payment. Shitty. So there's no way in. There might be, but I don't think you're going to like it. Vampires <sighs> aren't counted among the living. I could probably go through there without a problem. So you're saying I need to be a vampire to get into the soul cairn? Not your first choice, I guess? No. Is there another way? Maybe. We could just pay the toll another way. It wants a soul, so we give it a soul. Yours. I like my soul. I don't want to get rid of it. Won't that kill me? My mother taught me a trick or two. I could partially soul trap you and offer that gem to the ideal masters. It might be enough to satisfy them. All it would right. make you a bit weaker when we travel through the soul cairn, but we might be able to fix that once we're inside. Maybe. Maybe. Are those my only options? I'm sorry. I wish I knew a better way. Something that would be easier for you. Yeah. Just know that whatever path you choose, I won't think any less of you. Sometimes things just have to be done. I know that better than anybody. Well, we did the whole vampire thing in there already, so... Yeah, that's the trick. If you go the Dawnguard path and you're not a vampire, um, you either have to become a vampire or be so partially soul-trapped. What happens when you're partially soul-trapped? I have no idea. Let's Are find out! Soul-trap me! Are you sure? I'm willing to do it, but you need to think it through. What'll happen? You'll remain mortal, but you'll find yourself weakened within the soul cairn. Fine, whatever. I don't care. Uh, do I know it. this is difficult for you. I hope you trust me. I'm so badass you can weaken me and I'll still be like ten times more badass than anybody in there. I trust you. Thank you. Let's not waste any more time then. I do it! to make this as painless as possible. Hold still. Do it! Do it! Okay. Oh, oh my god. Ow! <laughs> Holy shit. You just had to okay me. Weakened soul added. So what does weakened soul do exactly? Let's find out. Um, I'm assuming it's here. No, no, maybe it's under powers. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what it does. Anyway, we're just not very good right now. So can we go? Did it work? Serana? Let's go. My mother must be waiting on the other side of the Okay, room. let's go. Okay, so I'm probably significantly weaker in here then. Well, that sucks. Hey, buddy. Oh, we talked to these people before. Anyway, we're just gonna get through this real quick. Supposedly, there's some uh, new steed you can get in here. Some like spectral steed. I don't think we're gonna do that. Let's just follow the path and get this over with as quickly as possible, shall we? Let's do so. Get out of here, weird soul thingy. Where'd you, know. you come from? We're under attack. Serana, we're under attack by Boonmen. Bone man! Oh. I don't seem that much weaker. I don't think I am. Maybe I have less stamina? Let's check it out. Do I? Oh, that's what happened. Yeah, all your health, stamina, and magic get, uh, like, uh, yeah. You must help me oh. find my Arvac. He doesn't deserve to be in a place like this. Who's Arvac? Calm down. Arvac, my horse. We came to this horrible place together. We were attacked by monsters, so I told him to run. Please, he's such a loyal creature, and he's been running for so long. You have to save him. A place like this will change you. Yeah, 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 whatever. Oh, how can I help him? Arvac! Where are you? Arvac, please come back! Come back! Uh, right. <laughs> Find Arvac skull in the soul cairn. I wonder, is that on my journal? Look at the. Look at the other quests. Um, if they can show it on the map, which I doubt they can. Current location, Valeria. Yeah, they're not gonna show it on the map. App it. I'm not going to spend hours upon end looking for this thing that I don't know where it is. So, whatever. <laughs> if you really want to find out where it is, I'll uh, leave something below and I'll look for it if you really want to know. But, for now, we're not looking for it. 
we're just gonna get through this soul carrying business as quickly as possible. You don't even talk to me, buddy. Don't even. What was that? <gasps> Dude, I I found a horse. There's a horse right there. Is that Arvac? Is that that horse you get? Well, that's kind of badass. He's all like purpley and skeletony and stuff. That's pretty cool. Um, I already have a horse though. I'm pretty attached to Frosty Balls already, so we're just gonna leave him be. Oh, he is pretty sweet. Whoa. Lightning. Whoa. I'm pretty sure Valertia is over here, though. Are we being attacked? I don't even know. I'm just wondering. What happened to Bran? I suppose Bran couldn't even come in here anyway. He'd have to be, like, partially soul-trapped as well. Jesus. Oh, are we under... We're under attack. The damn horse again. Hey, buddy. Bone ma'am. Bone man! Suck on that, bone man! Oh shit. Oh shit, Serana! I'll save you, Serana! You bastard! Taste the flame! Bah! Okay, that will teach him. Good input, Serana. Alright. Let us run to where we are going because it's taking far too long to get here. This kind of looks like the place. I think. It looks like something. Some sort of, like, evil cathedral or something. Uh, yeah, this is the place. I'm pretty sure. Yo, Valeria. Ah, there you are. Hey, Mother? you. Mummy. Mummy. It can't be. Serana? Is it really you? I can't believe it. How do we get inside? We have to talk. Serana, what are you doing here? Where's your father? He doesn't know we're here. I don't have time to explain. I must have failed. Harkon's found a way to decipher the prophecy, hasn't he? No, you've got it all wrong. We're here to stop him. To make everything right. Wait a moment. You've brought a stranger here? Have you lost your mind? Eh, uh, probably. No, you don't... You, come forward. I would speak with you. All right. What well, you want, so woman? So how has it come to pass that a vampire hunter is in the company of my daughter? <laughs> it pains me to think you'd travel with Serana under the guise of her protector in an effort to hunt me down. I was just after an elder scroll, dude. This is no ruse. I want to keep us safe. From one who murders vampires as a trade, I find it hard to believe your intentions are noble. How's being a vampire so noble, bitch? Everything to prevent Harkon from completing the prophecy. I would have expected her to explain that to you. Whatever. I'm just here for the you scroll. Think I'd have the audacity to place my own daughter in that tomb for the protection of her elder scroll alone. The scrolls are merely a means to an end. The key to the tyranny of the sun is Serana herself. Whoa. What do you mean? When I fled Castle Volkahar, I fled with two Elder Scrolls. The scroll I presume you found with Serana speaks of Ariel and his arcane weapon, Ariel's Bow. The second scroll declares that the blood of Cold Harbor's daughter will blind the eye of the dragon. So, how does Serana fit in? Like myself, Serana was a human once. We were devout followers of Lord Molig Ball. Tradition dictates the females be offered to Molig Ball on his summoning day. Few survive the ordeal. Those that do emerge as a pure-blooded vampire. We call such confluences the Daughters of Cold Harbor. Oh, what? Cold Harbor? It's what some call the domain of Molig Ball. His place in oblivion. So, the tyranny of the sun across Serana's blood? Now you're beginning to see why I wanted to protect Serana, and why I've kept the other Elder Scroll as far from her as possible. So, you're saying Lord Harkon means to kill her? Harkon obtained Ariel's bow, and Serana's blood was used to taint the weapon. The tyranny of the sun would be complete. In his eyes, she'd be dying for the good of all vampires. I guess I want to happen. Do you plan on stopping him? Well, I'll just murder his ass. If you believe that, 
then you're a bigger fool than I originally suspected. If you don't recognize don't Dragonborn when you see I him, you're a fool. Has Serana's opinion in this? You care nothing for Serana or our plight. I don't. I just Whether care about you killing bitches. One of us in order to survive the Soul Cairn, you're still a vampire hunter at heart. That's right, bitch. You're here because we're abominations in your mind. Evil creatures that need to be destroyed. I'm here because being a vampire blows. I'm just here for the scroll. You're simply here to stop the tyranny of the sun, despite the cost to Serana. Nothing. Oh my see. god, fuck off, bitch. This stranger aligns himself with those that would hunt you down and slay you like an animal. Yet I should entrust you to him. This stranger has done more for me in the brief time I've known him than you've done in centuries. She's got a point. How dare you? I gave up everything I cared about to protect you from that fanatic you call a father. Yes, he's a fanatic. He's changed. But he's still my father. Why can't you understand how that makes me feel? Oh, Serana. If you'd only open your eyes the moment your father discovers your role in the prophecy. That he needs your blood. You'll be in terrible danger. So to protect me, you decided to shut me away from everything I cared about. That's a little messed up. You never asked me if hiding me in that tomb was the best course of action. You just expected me to follow you blindly. Both of you were obsessed with your own paths. Your motivations might have been different, but in the end, I'm still just a pawn to you too. Wow. I want us to be a family again. But I don't know if we can ever have that. Maybe it's not looking good. That kind of happiness. Maybe it isn't for us. But we have to stop him. Before he goes too far. And to do that, we need the Elder Scroll. I'm sorry, Serana. I didn't know. I didn't see. I've allowed my hatred of your father to estrange us for too long. Forgive me. That's you right! the Elder Scroll, it's yours. Fork it over. Your intentions are still somewhat unclear to me. But for Serana's sake, I'll assist you in any way that I can. Damn right. Do you have the Elder Scroll with yes. you? I've kept it safely secured here ever since I was imprisoned. Fortunately, you're in a position to breach the barrier that surrounds these ruins. What do we need to do? We need to locate the tallest of the rocky spires that surround these ruins. At their bases, the barrier's energy is being drawn from unfortunate souls that have been exiled here. Destroy the keepers that are tending them, and it should bring the barrier down. Okay, we'll be back soon. One more word of warning. There's a dragon that calls itself Dernevere roaming the cairn. Be wary of him. The ideal masters have charged him with overseeing the keepers, and will undoubtedly intervene if you're perceived as a threat. Okay, so... We gotta go kill the bone yard keepers and junk. And keep my daughter safe. Um, we probably won't show this, but we will show um the whole talking of stuff with Mr. Lizard King and what's her face who hates me, um Valerica. Because there's different dialogue and stuff. We wanna show the differences between uh, you know, the uh vampire dog guard thing and the normal human dog guard thing. So, I'm glad you're here. we'll skip a little bit next I time. I'll see you then.